Hello friends, so welcome back. In this video, I'm going to create a Laravel 9 application and make our first test. So first I'm going to open the terminal and I'm going to go in the direct directory where I want to install the Laravel project. And here I'm going to say Laravel new and uh, I'm going to say Laravel testing and it's going to create a new project in here okay wait for the laravel installation okay now cd in the laravel testing and I'm going to open this with VS code and also if I come here and go to the laravel dash testing dot test yeah we have our project here and here we have the laravel 9 and PHP version 8.1.1 okay so in our project if you see the here is the Laravel project and we have the tests uh, directory and in here we have the feature what the Laravel documentation set okay so we have the feature and unit folder and here is the example for uh, the Laravel feature test and here is the unit test now with this unit we have a test that true is true so this assert true is true and this example test test the application returns a successful response and you see here how long is that that is the say what we want so for here we need with the title of this uh, function we know what we want so test the application return a successful response and we associate in the response with this get slash so the home page and there is a response uh, assert status 200 so when we go to the uh, this home page here we need to see if we have a response 200 so if i refresh you see here the status is 200 okay and or we can uh, create a test php artisan make test users test or if you if we want a unit test we can add the flag unit or if we want a best test what i said in the previous video we can add the best flag here and the example is there and uh, if we run this command so come here open the terminal and run this command pitch vendor bin php unit we have the okay green status which is uh, good and we have two tests and two assertions as passed or we can use this one php artisan test and also this pass we have the test unit example test that true is true and also a test feature example test this application return a successful response okay uh, what i want to do is uh, in my sorry i 
I'm going to add in my SSH RC file. I'm going to add the two aliases for the test. So here I have added PHP unit for this one, vendor bin PHP unit and test for PHP artisan test. And if you do that, So now if I uh, just run test, we have the same thing. And if I run PHP unit, also the same thing. Okay, friends, that is for this video. In the next video, we are going to make some changes to, to our first test and see what happened. All the best, friends.